Looky here, looky here. Brand new plow. Hey? Yeah. Minute mount two. Just in time, we got what eight to twelve inches coming tomorrow. Yeah. Oh boy, everything's thawed out. We'll get into this more in a minute here. We got to go see about some better snow tires. I figured I spent all nice. that money. This is the controller for it. Remote one. Pretty cool. Yeah. It's like playing a video game today. Ba boom yeah. I'm scared I'm scared I'm scared so nice well now he's getting uh, snow plow well not snow plow but some new tires for the truck mounted <laughs> that's gonna be total with the with the plow over 6500 bucks in, in 24 hours now to help now to help pay for that we got to go pick up a pile of leaves for a guy I got a haircut today thanks to the wifey got to pay for that plow now so anyway uh, Somebody's got bragging rights this morning. Yeah. Bragging rights. Go Pens Go 291. Jeremy up there in uh, Nova Scotia. Up in Halifax. Big Pittsburgh Penguins fan. Beat my beloved Bruins last night. Mr. Crosby had the first goal and the final goal. It's a good game, though. Good game. A little, should have been a little more fighting, though. I like the fights. <laughs> anyway, you can see the, the leaves in the mirror there. I'm here. Bunch of oak leaves. Nasty. Oh, look what I found here. Nice. And I don't have a rake, so I gotta wait for Colin to get here. But this is all gotta go in my truck. Oh boy. Anyway, while I got time, I uh, I want to give a shout out to Jeremy and his mother Ellen up there in Nova Scotia, Halifax. Jeremy said he wanted to uh, try to build my subs for me and help me get some more subscribers and stuff. And uh, he's been mentioning me in this video, and I appreciate that 100,000%. Um, we're building on our little re hockey rivalry at the moment. And uh, his uh, Penguins beat us last night. Mr. Crosby beat us. Uh, first and last goal. But uh, anyway, check out uh, Go Pens Go 291. Um, the, uh, he's actually, um, oh, here we go, here. He's actually got um, the uh, number of subs that he, he, he got from his uncle, too, uh, Uncle Bill up there in Ontario. Bill's T Max. But anyway, let me get this going here. Yeah, he'll box them in his truck. You know how much of a pain in the ass it is to get these out with one hand? You know? Oh, boy. It's not right. There we go. 
Ugh, chocolate. Well, chocolate and mint. Not too bad. Stay. For as soon as you get the tarp out, the wind picks up, no? Yeah. That's awesome. Yeah. You know? Why not? Hey, Papa. Ruby. Come here, buddy. Hey, Ruby. This is Ruby, boys and girls. Nice old dog. Nice old dog. Yeah. All right, I got my first load here. Probably gonna have two loads. A neighbor come over with some bags of shit too. I gotta put it in the truck. But uh, do I smell? Anyway, uh, this this place we're taking these leaves is a composter. He's got uh, he takes in all kinds of this stuff, rots it down, and turns it into uh, compost and resells it, of course. And uh, If he's running the uh, big Volvo loader, I'll put that on video. But uh, anyway, again, uh, thanks to Jeremy and uh, Ellen up there in Nova Scotia. Uh, appreciate all the help. And, uh, you know, like I said, uh, us redheads got to stick together, you know. <laughs> oh, shit, look at this here. Should I hit it? Whoop. <laughs> I just ran that bag of leaves over. Oh. The car behind me is not happy, but anyway. Uh, <laughs> not happy. There's our pile of leaves. I don't know what the, t the camera's doing for justice. And this is his composting process. It's a pretty neat system, but the loader's not around, so. Anyway. It's almost like one of them things they're using on the. Uh, up there in Alaska to sift through to get the gold, you know. Kind of cool. I'll take a better look in another day here. It's probably pretty windy, but I'll take a walk around as soon as I dump this stuff. Anyway, it's too windy, so I'm going to drive around it. But there we are. It's kind of neat. Neat old machine. I don't know what it's worth. Load everything in on this end. It just sifts through all the heavy stuff. And the screen takes out the thick stuff. The big rocks dump down here. Yeah, kind of neat. Someday I'll come up here when this thing is running. I'll show you. Do a little video on it. It's a pretty neat operation. Got little brushes there to take the cleans the uh, screen off. Those little rotary brushes there. Yeah, this is this is quite the operation when it's running. So I'll I'll add that to another video someday. And uh, Dickens here, so Dick and Crane. There's one of the mansions in town. There's three of them that the Crane family own. That was one. Here's another one. Back then when you had money, you showed it off by building big buildings to live in. There's another one up there they call Sugar Hill. That's actually a retirement home now. Oh my lord, what's going on here? 